I did not grow up in a political family. I was a nurse by profession, married a farmer, moved to his family farm. We were very happily married for 11 years and he was killed in a farm accident. At that point in time, I wanted to take over the management of our farm, so I got very involved in both the Indiana Farm Bureau and the Corn Growers Association. That took me as a volunteer to the State House to speak before the Senate Agriculture and House Agriculture Committees on farm issues. As a result of that, I was talked into running for the State Senate by two of the Senators that were on the uh, Agriculture Committee back in, it would have probably been 1987. I've never worried at all about being a female in this setting. I never worry about the fact that I'm a female and I serve with a majority of male senators. I'm pretty strong-willed and determined. There's probably some times when the guys that I serve with wonder why I'm so tough. If you really think that you would like to make a difference in your community, then this is the kind of thing you should do. If it's something you really think you want, then if it's a political direction that you want to take, you should get involved with your uh, political party of your choice at the local level, uh, start attending their events, volunteer for other campaigns. I'm per the perfect example of if you think you're politically inclined, even if you've had no political background, if I can do it, you can do it. <laughs>